What's going on, my good folks? It's your man, your guy, your boy, 1127 Kicks. Today is Tuesday, man. We one day away from hump day, bro. It already feel like it's been a long week already, man. But we're getting through. We're pushing through, man. I really hope this week go by slow because my wife and my daughter, they're flying out this weekend to uh, see my mother-in-law and everything like that. So I'm going to be, like, stuck here by myself. And... It's going to be pretty boring around here, bro. So I'll be dropping a lot of content just to keep my mind busy and stuff like that because it's going to be lame while they gone. So if you haven't checked out my video when I uh, peed on the wall, supposedly, man, make sure you go check that video out, man. And make sure you don't tell on your homies, bro. Man, be, be, a, be a true homie. Don't do that. So with that being said, today, man, it has been confirmed. The Air Jordan 6 Travis Scott's. Shout out to my wife, man. Make sure y'all subscribe to her page and everything like that. She she told me they will be dropping on Friday. Now, they will be dropping via Sneakers app. Also, they're dropping on the Foot Action app, but it's only in places like Chicago and LA. That's it. And the Sneakers app, they're doing a drawing. And uh, it's a lot of other places that's overseas rivals that's doing a drawing and everything like that. And that's exactly how those shoes are going to come out. Me personally, when I seen that it was a drawing on there, of course, I was just like, dang, man. I only hit on the drawing once, and it was, it was ironically, the Air Jordan 1, Travis Scott's, uh, the, low, the lows. I actually hit on those, man. So, I'm not completely, like, just feeling down and out, man. I have my hopes up to actually get that shoe. I really actually want that one, and I definitely want to bring it to you guys and do a review on that shoe. Now, with that being said, it's a draw. So make sure you're up early. Make sure you're on your app, man. Depending on how long it is, you hey, it's, it's gonna be crazy, man. Because I remember like usually sneaker raffles, they're like 10, five to 10 minutes most of the time. The last time when they did the Air Jordan 1 low, it was 30 minutes. It was a 30 minute draw. And a lot of people hit on there. So me personally, if you see that it's a 30 minute draw or something like that, you have a great chance of actually getting that shoe. Also, with the resale value of that shoe, I'm predicting like right now when you look on StockX, it's up there in the thousands and everything. I believe my size 12 is almost a thousand or maybe a thousand right now. Um, of course, when the shoe first comes out and everything like that, you will definitely see the prices actually drop because there's so many pairs out there that eventually it'll go up. But then I feel like that price will uh, level out to like 600 to $700. It won't be like the Air Jordan 1 uh, OG highs, you know, because overall, like, Air Jordan 1 OG highs are the most sought out after shoe, especially for resale that has the most value. Even though this is definitely a hard shoe, the Air Jordan 6 Travis Scott is still not going to hold more value than an Air Jordan 1 OG high with the backwards swoosh on there. And it, I believe it will hold a little more value than the Air Jordan 1 lows, but... You know, me personally, that's my favorite one, but it will hold more value than the lows because not a lot of people's feeling the lows. People just bought that off the hype. But at the same time, since the lows didn't come back out and Nike actually pulled those back, hey, you know, the value of the lows is going to go up uh, most definitely. But I believe that will be around the $600, $700 price range. So don't trip off of it if you don't get it, man. Because honestly, even though it might go for go between $600 and $700, you might have that guy that's trying to get the shoes off his hand quick. And you might get it for a, a lesser price, man. Because uh, once again, like I said, when the shoe initially comes out, you know what I'm saying? It's going to be a whole bunch of pairs and people just going to be getting them off their hands and stuff like that. And then when, you know, as time goes by, the stock goes up and then eventually it will just level out. Because just be honest, a month from now, not even a month from now, by the time the Air Jordan 1 Shattered Backboard 3.0s come out, nobody's going to be thinking about the Travis Scott 6s anymore. You dig what I'm saying? So you just got to think about that right there. But honestly, like I said before, if you are going for that shoe, man, I'm speaking it to existence. You will get that shoe. I will get that shoe. Even though it's a drawing, it's going to happen. You already know over here at 1127 Kicks, it's nothing but positive vibes. So if you're watching this video right now, you plan on getting Travis Scott's, you will get the Travis Scott's, and I'm going to get the Travis Scott's, and we all going to win out here. You dig what I'm saying? I just want to put that positive vibe, that positive, um, you know what I'm saying, aura in the air for y'all. 
because I know a lot of people's like, well, I'm taking L's, I'm taking L's. Honestly, I'm not even looking at videos that talking about get your L's ready and stuff like that, man. Because we don't take L's around here, man. We learn lessons and we get dubs around here all day, every day. So, and also the page is 1127 Kicks. You search for good, you find a favor. You search for evil, we'll find you. You dig what I'm saying? So, let's search for good and we sure gonna get a favor. You dig what I'm saying? So, I just wanted to put that out there for y'all. Make sure I keep on liking, subscribing to the page, man. Support the movement all day, every day. And it's your boy 1127 Kicks. And always remember, bless your feet with something. Who did hit me up and told me shit on these niggas? Cause these niggas out here came back to go on showing the different. Keep on dropping all of that shit that made these for wanna listen. You know these niggas ain't fucking tellin' get out of here.